So I was like, I have to do like this nose thing was like my goal of making these. So I went on Amazon, I literally Googled every sort of creative sewing, metal, aluminum, strip thing. Everything was sold out. So then I was like, I'm keep on Googling aluminum, aluminum, aluminum. So I was like, why don't I just try aluminum foil? So as you see on this map here, you see my nose piece. So I actually took aluminum foil, I folded it, folded it, folded it, and that's what I used in this mask for the nose piece. So if you're out there, you can't find a nose piece metal for your mask, for your DIY mask, go into your pantry and get some aluminum foil because it seriously works. I don't think it's washable um, and you might need to replace it. I actually just attached this with some of this sewing tape stuff. I'm not exactly sure what it's called, but I'll uh, write the name in my bio. But basically, you take an iron, you hold it down, and it sticks to any surface. I actually also use that to create some of my pleats because I was getting like super lazy. But there we go. <sighs> What I'm doing with my mask is I'm putting a slit in the back so that people can put whatever filter they want in it, um, depending on what they have. I have this little piece right here. I'm not sure if you can see it, but it's actually a medical grade filter that my aunt gave me from the hospital. But see, I put the filter in right here. And the cool thing about this mask is that you can wash it. Um, and cotton is supposedly like one of the best materials to use in terms of breathability and being protective. Um, so I'll just show you put it on. My little brother's standing there watching me. It's like a lot of pressure. <laughs> okay, here we go. So here's my mask. 